welcome back to my channel. My name is Grace. I am a realistic wellness, fitness, lifestyle vlogger, capturing mainly my weight loss journey, but this video is gonna be a little bit different. This is a short but sweet travel vlog. I am filming this right now a couple weeks later because I'm a little bit behind with my editing, but upon reviewing my intro that I filmed at the airport, it became very clear that the audio just was not working that day. I'm not sure why that is or what happened, but I filmed a intro explaining what happened in my last vlog briefly, which if you hadn't seen that hurricane vlog, you should know that I had been without power for a couple days. It was pretty uncomfortable because it is still hot here in Savannah, Georgia, so we really were feeling it at night when we were trying to sleep and also uh, didn't help when it came to packing and preparing for this trip. But we were very fortunate in that our power came back on the day of uh, my departure about mid-morning, so I had a little bit of time to prepare. So without further ado, please enjoy this short but sweet travel vlog to Mystic, Connecticut for Labor Day weekend. first morning that I woke up in Mystic, Connecticut, we were still getting set up for my sister's 25th birthday. She had a lot of her friends from college coming from out of town. My mom had created and orchestrated this whole carnival themed birthday party for her. So there were a lot of uh, carnival games and outdoor activities. Before most of the guests started arriving, we did swing out to Nana's, which is this new bakery coffee shop. This had opened since I have moved to Savannah, so this is my first time at Nana's. I got a pistachio latte, I think it was, and a chocolate croissant. When we got back to the house, more and more of Hope's friends started arriving. Uh, some of the carnival games we played were bobbing for lemons. There was a competition to see whose team could eat apple cider donuts off a of string the fastest, a toilet paper mummy competition, and lastly, there was a hands-free pie eating competition. Whoever eats the majority of the donut, they're eating the first bite. Whoever does not eat the donut, they're eating the rest of the pie. Somebody get a picture of it. Ready? Three, two, one, go! Hope cheated. Perfect. And after the carnival games, we walked down to the Mystic Marina to spend some time by the water. Before dinner, we had some kebabs. It was delicious. And then we sang happy birthday to Hope. And the next morning, my mom had put out a continental breakfast for Hope's guests who had spent the night. We finally had a chance to play pinata. Way to go, Hope. And after a lot of the party goers had gone home, a few of us went to take a boat ride with Dad.
Hopefully you can hear me okay, but it's a couple days later. It's Sunday. Yesterday we celebrated Hope's birthday with a kind of day-long party where throughout the, uh, the afternoon we were playing carnival games. Before most of the people showed up, we did go out and get a croissant. Well, I got a croissant coffees mostly at a place called Nana's which is kind of new to me uh, near the, the Sea Swirl location which is a popular ice cream parlor here in Mystic and then this morning we decided to go out on the boat for a quick boat ride around the uh, river and down off of Ender's Island. Most of Hope's friends have since gone home. Her boyfriend is here and I think tonight we're gonna go out for dinner somewhere local I'm not sure if we've really decided yet, but I think the votes have been for Costello's so far, and that's over in No Ink, if I'm not misremembering. This is my last full day. Tomorrow will be kind of a part day, leaving in the mid-afternoon. This has been what I've, I've needed, I think. It's good to be home. We didn't realize until I got here that it's been about... I'll be right there! It's been about five years. I'm gonna go hang out. We're on a secondary boat trip. Going the other direction of the river. And then we ended the evening by going to Costello's of Noang for fresh seafood. What are we doing today? What are we gonna do? It is my last day here. It's kind of like a half day. I'll be leaving mid-afternoon, but Dad's making breakfast. We're just gonna spend some quality time together before I head out. I should probably help. 